Howdy y'all and welcome back to another game with Fritterbug Gaming. Today's game is Resident Evil. I know it's been a couple days since I've been on and today's video was out a little bit later but the reason for that is because of a big storm that came through town so didn't want a chance being online when a storm broke out. I was at my mother's house instead. So today we will continue on where we left off last week with some Resident Evil. I know we still had a lot we were in the middle of doing this past week and we had a lot to continue up. Um, I haven't really been back on since the other day. So is that another book to pick up or something? Well, not looking to save anything there. Okay, what do we need to do now? Well, oh yes, that is what we were doing. We actually managed to get ourselves killed before we took these masks back. Because we didn't have any of the ink ribbons left, did we? So, we're going to have to find some ink ribbons on our path today, hopefully, if we can. We've still got to also find out where it is we need to go next. Let's see. We've got a fuel canteen that we're going to need. I'm pretty sure anyway. Don't think there's anything else in here that we need. But right now I think what I'm going to do is put this in this box just until we get back so we can make sure we have enough room in case we have to pick anything up ink ribbons and such <sighs> let's make sure we're actually recording today because yesterday's video the reason that we didn't actually have a video for yesterday is the recording got messed up halfway through recording it and it was already too late by the time I had realized it, so couldn't exactly restart. Okay, we have a few rooms that we can't get into, and a few rooms that might possibly be able to get into. I don't think we have any keys, but we're going to go ahead and make our way outside. I know we don't have a lot to do. Well, clearly we do since we're all the way back here. But hopefully we can find some of the stuff that we were missing this in the last week's episode and get a little bit further than what we did anyway there. Don't get stuck behind a pole now. That's the last thing we need. Okay. Time to head down to the Crimson Boss. Oh, don't need anything over that way. And we've already checked over there, so... Don't have any more shotgun ammo in there. Wish we could get that thing off the wall there, but after you've gone down here, I guess you can't. Okay, so we've got those masks. This one's the nose mask right here. Use. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead. Okay, we've already got it equipped, so we're good there. <laughs> I was getting kind of nervous seeing that little shake of the thing. Even though we fought it before, I mean, we know what we're in for, but it's still about about the scenes. Okay. Crimson boss. Let's go ahead. Stay 
stand back up. I know you've done it. It's like he's trying to play dead with me. Come on. I know you want to get up. And that's how you finish the box. Ooh, they have some awful looking claws. I would not want to be fighting against one of those in real life. I can tell you that much for sure. Too much of a hassle. Ah, so there we go. We've got ourselves our stone and metal object. Alright, and now I remember where it was we were at. So we had gotten the stone and metal object and we're working our way towards heading outside with that dog in the very back room. The one hallway that we had gotten towards the beginning of our Resident Evil series. Um, but, well, <laughs> I can tell you this, it's been a little while since we've been out there. Besides the last episode when we attempted to go out there. I know there's a lot over there though that we haven't yet explored and I'm quite excited to find out what's all over there. So where do we have to move, make our way to? Let's see. Let's see this map. I do believe it was the second floor that we had to go up to. But I'm not sure. It might be on the bottom floor. Um, let's see here. Okay, so we're going to have to run through the dog area first, I do believe. And then once we are through the dog area, then... I hope we don't have to shoot those again, because that would be a pain. You stay... Well, clearly I can't take care of that from on my side. I thought I moved that dresser before and block him in better, but clearly he's still trying to get to me. I guess we killed the dogs in the last episode and it saved. Clearly. Because we don't have no dogs in this hallway anymore. Okay, so we are in this hallway now. All we have to do is make our way back here to the very back and we should be out in the area that we need to be in. Okay. I don't like how close up that is. Oh yeah. Hmm, we will equip that. this out of the screen. You getting up or staying down? Okay, well I'm glad to see both of you have decided you want to stay down. <laughs> oh, come on, I am close enough. Okay, so we're going, I wish it could, just, it could just spread to that body because it's so close, but I know it won't. Okay, so we're going to have to go out here and grab our fuel. Uh, yes, that means we're going to have to deal with the dogs. But you know what? Better to get them, kill them, and take care of that than to deal with them over and over again. Come on, doggy. I'm not in the mood for this. How did that get him? I'm telling you, the shot on this thing is clearly way too good. <laughs> okay, let's turn around. Yes, we want kerosene. Okay, and we want that herb. Don't think we have anything else to go with it, but at least we've got the herb now. 
and now we don't even have to worry about this door anymore and worrying about if there's dogs out here or not. As long as we can find another tie, uh, typewriter and another ink ribbon, then we should be good. Okay. Use. Burn that body. The less crimson heads we have to deal with, the better. So, let's not. And just say we did. I don't have any herbs. See, was there a checkpoint over here? Yes, but if we go into that checkpoint, we will be stuck in there for right now, or we'll have to run the entire way back around just in order to get back out here. Hopefully we can survive. I sure am hoping. Sometimes you can't tell, so. Wish, pray for me, guys. <laughs> Might be going, having some trouble. Come on, doggy. Oh, were you down after one shot? Good thing we don't have to burn those bodies. That's all I can say. Okay. Add that item. Okay. And we are going to need to combine. There we go. Now we've got a six shots at least. <sighs> Wish me luck, guys. I don't think there was anything in this room particularly. But I do know we had some stuff in other rooms that were close by. Okay, more shotgun shells. That's what we need. Is there something over here in this corner? Ooh, another battery pack. So, assorted pots and toolbox. First aid spray. Okay, and this, let's see, let's look at the doors. Okay, so we've got one little door down here and one little door out here. This one leads out to the pool, if I remember correctly. But where did this one lead? Let's see. Let us check. Where does this door lead? What will we find behind the big white door? Okay, North Valley of Destruction. Uh, south is Cave of Hatred. East is Summit of Madness. I think that's what that says. And West is Path of Revenge. Okay, so we're, I don't think we're looking to go this way yet, are we? Let's see where it leads us. There's nothing down here. So we, we can, oh, oh. Okay, so what is this? This is something I haven't seen before. A statue with red eyes. The inscription reads, The War Cry of Revenge. The war cry of revenge on that one. What does that say? Does it let me say, read it? It says, The gate will open when the guard dog's desires are fulfilled. Okay, so what was it that we said? It was the. Let's see here. We'll have to read those signs again in order to know what way we've got to turn it, don't we? I bet you we do. Let's see here. So it was the for the west for the path of revenge, east for summit of madness, south for cave of hatred, and north for valley of destruction. Okay, so north, south, 
west and east. Okay. I don't know if I'll be able to keep that in mind and know which one is actually the correct way. Okay. North, south, west, and east. Okay. And then I'm heading to the east. And then now back to the south. Right? Okay. A statue with red eyes. The inscription reads, The War Cry of Revenge. Okay, and if I remember correctly, I don't know how we... One moment, guys. So... Alright, guys. Sorry about that. I had to take a small bathroom break. Um, but... Okay, so we've got two statues here. Let's see, what does this one have anything it says? Let's see. Clearly not. Oh, a statue with blue eyes. The inscription reads, The Last Gasp of Destruction. Okay, so this one's the Dog of Destruction. And this one is the Revenge. Okay, so we're probably going to have to turn them somehow out how we're going to turn those. So blue one here. There's a switch here. Press it. Okay. Let's look again real quick to see what the other inscriptions on that one said. So we know we have one for destruction and we have one for revenge. Okay. So we've got seems to be some kind of signpost. Each direction is accompanied by a corresponding destination. North is the Valley of Destruction. South, Cave of Hatred. East, Summit of Madness. West, Path of Revenge. Alright, so it seems that we're going to have to set those up. West for the Path of Revenge. And if I remember correctly, the Destruction Dog had blue eyes. So we're going to go this one. We can click it. I don't think that that's the right way. And I don't think that's the right way either. <laughs> course it's going to stay still. Haha, -ha, there we go. We've got it stopped on that one. Okay, now that one should be the correct direction. And we don't want to press that again. <laughs> okay. And I think that would mean that this one would have to be on north. Wrong one. Okay. Haha, -ha, there we go. Hey, there we go. I heard that unlock. Okay, so we've gotten into this door now. Maybe if we're lucky, we can find us some ink ribbons in here. Because without any ink ribbons, how are we going to save our game? don't like them crows. Should I go ahead and take care of you? I don't know that I necessarily trust you. <laughs> Feathers flying everywhere. Come on, get off my head. have no extra health. We've got a graveyard in here. What is this? Lots of stuff. There's something carved into the indentation. 
two vertical lines and a cross and three horizontal lines. Could it be some kind of symbol? They look kind of like the little items that we used to get out here. There's something written in this indentation. When the wind sweeps across the earth, stars will shine in the heavens. Okay, so that could be the wind one that we found earlier. I'm really liking this remake of this game. Let's see. Can we go through this door yet? Looks like we can. Where are we heading now? I'm already hurt. It's not like I need something else to add to the pain. Okay, I know I just heard something out here. Character is hurting so bad. Oh. oh, there's something. There's a building right there. I don't know that I trust this building. <laughs> Never have I seen it before, so. Oh boy. Okay, so we're going to probably have to mix these herbs, combine with this one, and use. Okay, I forgot we actually had that one healing potion, healing spray potion, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so there we go, we got that. Is there anything else out here that we need to grab? I don't know if it'll even show us. So we missed something out here, clearly. What did we miss? Ooh, I guess we'll have to find out when we go back through. Is there anything out here we need to look for or search? Anything? I guess that's the limit of what we can run out here. Oh yes. Let's hope we don't open the door to some zombie. Fire flickering. I hear it. Is there something in this room? It's the last thing I need. Ah, nice warm fire. Let's cozy up by this for a moment. Ah, at least I got my toes nice and warm. Okay, so is there anything in this building is the question. So clearly we've got some items in here to collect. Is that a map? Yes, it is. Alrighty, so now we've got some little pathways we can take. Okay, so, wow, we've got a lot of area. Clearly we still got to explore. You got the map of the courtyard. Ooh. Hey, there's a typewriter. So you got any ink ribbons in here? Boots on the bed and everything. Goodness, goodness, goodness. A family picture. Not really much of a family picture, huh? It says, a family picture and some notes. My dearest Lisa. There's a journal left by someone. 19. Daddy attached first, mom attached sconed. Inside, red and slimy, white and hard. Not true, mom, where? Dunno, dad, found mom again. When they attached mommy, she moved no more. She's screaming. Why? Just want to be with her. Mom, where? I miss you. I take it that was written by a child because that was English all over the place. Oh, thanks. 
if I had an ink ribbon, I would save it. Okay, well, you know, that's just not helpful, is it? Well, maybe if we're lucky, we will find us an ink ribbon somewhere in here. From here, you've got a good view of the entrance of the cabin. Well, it doesn't help us in getting a ink ribbon, does it? You know, it would only be helpful if that had an ink ribbon in it. But I'm pretty sure I checked it already, and it doesn't. So let's check. Nope, lots of red herbs, though. And a ceramic survival knife, but no ink ribbons at all. Though it does look like we have actually explored this area, though the problem is, is there's something that we're missing, and I'm not sure where it is. I'd love to know, though. this item that we are missing that's in here. Clearly there's got to be something, right? Well, that's what you think. Hmm. Give me a moment, guys. I'm going to have to check this out. All right, guys, so what it's trying to tell me to do online is search everything in the place. A crude bed. It looks like no one's used it in a long time. We've already checked out the window. I didn't realize we could even climb down right here. Ah, there's something. Maybe that's what we needed. So was that all we had in here? Yes, it was. All right, so we've got ourselves a little crank, but what are we gonna do with this? <coughs> okay, we obviously can't save here. Well, I wish we could have saved. Because there's something there. What is that? Maybe I can escape and save some ammunition? Because <laughs> I don't know that I necessarily have enough for this. Maybe she can't chase me? That's what I'm hoping for anyway. <laughs> but I think that's what we were hearing when we were walking up. And that's... Interesting way to die. Is he going to stay down this time? Never quite sure if they will or not. A large statue stands silently in the darkness. Not much of anything interesting, but at least we read it. So, is there something out here we've got to collect? We shall see. Is there anything 
shiny that I'm not seeing. Maybe. I don't know. Is there something over here? I mean, I know we've got to get... I know we've got to get that wind crest, but besides that, I don't think we have any of the other pieces yet, so this may be later into the game. Um, but we can head the other direction. I know we had another direction up here that we needed to move to. Uh, let's see. Maybe if we're lucky, we can find something down at the water, the pool, maybe we can find something out there. Not sure, not until we go up there. Okay, now that we've made our way back in this door, we can make our way out to the pool. there was anything left in here that we needed to grab, was there? No. Okay. Oh, no! Did it realize there was two of them out here? No, there's three of them. Oh, that's terrific. Come on, open inventory. We need herbs and a lot of them. Okay, and we need to also... Oh, that's already equipped. I like it how one shot took two dogs down. That was nice. <laughs> Okay, so we've got a blue herb also. We'll go ahead and mix these two herbs so that way we can pick up the third herb. Okay, and I do believe we've gotten everything from out here. Yes. Okay, so now that we are set right there, who knows? find when we walk a little further in. Okay, so there's nothing here it looks like. Maybe that's an area that the elevator is supposed to come down? I'd like to assume that way, but I'm not sure. Mmm, we've got another door. Oh yeah, this is the one to the pool. Of course. Okay, so we are obviously going to get to go down there today, because that's what that crank was, wasn't it? Aha! Come on, it's a crank! It looks like it belongs. Use. I remember something about draining water from the original game. That's why this looks so ancient like it is. Something about draining water from some sort of water. You can hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance. I don't think that's the distance. I think you're hearing it close up. My friend. Okay, so let's head down the ladder and hopefully find something we haven't seen before. I would be afraid that something would come out of that drain and get me. I don't know why, but if I was put in that situation in real life, I would be scared. Badly. <laughs> So where are we going is my question. Since we've never been in this elevator before, we're always going somewhere special. Really? More birds? Hmm. 
think what I'm going to do is I'm going to combine these with these. So that way we at least know we have enough ammo. Why are you aiming over there? The bird's right in front of your face. Okay. I won't mess with you as long as you don't mess with me, birds. You understand me? You stay in your tree, and we'll all be good. Peachy, to be exact. Oh no, we don't even have space to pick it up. Of course not. Of course not. Ooh, more birds. Isn't that what we love? All the pleasant little birds that want to be around us. The battery has been taken out. Okay, so what do we use here then? Doesn't tell us. <laughs> Or somewhere, but where is the stuff we put in it? Because clearly we haven't found anything. Hmm, very interesting. Where are we to go now? Looks like there's something over here. Oh no! Of course! The birds all start attacking me for no reason. No reason at all. Just saying, but... Oh yeah, the shots on this game are just impeccable. <laughs> you can shoot about anywhere. Where'd that other bird go? I know it's over here somewhere. I saw it. Where it went off to, though. Thought I had it. Come by. I'm sure I'm going to need you. There's somewhere over here I've got to go. Somewhere. Clearly, I haven't found it yet. Okay, we find this power source. I mean, we've been finding... Oh, hello. Gates. To somewhere we have never been before. Red herbs. Wonderful. I don't like these little holes over here. Or snakes. Can you avoid the snakes? Yeah, you can. Says we're in the residence, so either we found a back door or something. <laughs> oh my, at all the blue herbs. I take it I need blue herbs for something. Is there any other doors in here that I might have missed? Nope, not that way. in here. Oh, we've got some healing spray, but we don't have any space to carry it. Well, we've got a typewriter, but yay, we've got an ink ribbon, but no way to use it. Okay, well, we do need to use this. Well, I didn't want to combine it. I actually wanted to use it. 
<laughs> All right, so I am going to pick up this battery pack because I know it won't take up a inventory slot. And we're going to pick up that ink ribbon. Yes, look, we've got this little buddy now. See if there's anything in here. Ooh, we've got a chest and we've got more fuel. I love it. Okay, guys, so like uh, we are finally to the point where we can finally call our video. Um, but if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you hit that like, share, and subscribe and show my channel some support if you really enjoy today's video. So that way I can continue bringing out more content for you guys. All right, and let's see here. Let's get some of this added in here to the chest because I know I've got an empty, a few empty items. Um, that'll open up some spaces for us for the next time we come on. I'm pretty sure I moved around this stuff that was in my inventory before, but for some reason it's moved down. So let's just get that reorganized for you guys so that way it'll all be together. herb in that slot and make them in the inventory like right there. Okay, so now we should be set guys for the next time that we log on. Love it when we can refill our fuel canteen. Is there anything else we've missed? Anything? There's still clearly plenty we've missed, but Hopefully it's just the stuff that's laying around that we just couldn't pick up at the moment. Okay, and we've got us some first aid spray. So I'm gonna go ahead and save guys. And if you guys want to check me out next week, I will continue the progress. Now that we've got it saved, I will see you guys in the next week's episode. Bye!